we are very honored uh, to have uh, Venerable Cheng De uh, as our um, uh, 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 guest speaker, as our teacher of the day. Uh, we will conduct this uh, forum uh, on a Q&A basis. Uh, everyone, uh, I encourage to have a questions beforehand as announced. Uh, so that you know we can uh, pick your questions uh, uh, in a queue and bring it up for discussions. And this discussion should be open for everyone, not just uh, venerable or uh, a, a host. Uh, I'm honored to be your host today, and I will be uh, translated today as well. Uh, feel free to um, uh, bring up your questions uh, as we speak. Uh, very happy to see a lot of uh, young people and a lot of uh, practitioners, uh, Dharma practitioners, to uh, gather here today uh, to exchange uh, ideas, exchange uh, you know, our heartfelt words. Uh, 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 uh very happy to see everyone taking part in uh, learning of the five thousand years of the you know traditional Chinese history. Uh, uh, Chinese culture and the values. Um, uh, it's, as we say, right, youth is the most cherished golden period in uh, one's life uh, because it's full of possibilities. Um, I think Lao Tzu, Lao Tzu uh, uh, the um, ancient sages once said, uh, before 20 years old, it was like spring. Everything is full of life, uh, blossoming. And from 20 to 30, it's like uh, summer, you know, it's time to put in our work. And from 40 to 60 is like autumn, uh, you know, it's time for harvesting, you know, to reap what we have sowed. And the last one is 60 onwards, it's like the winter, it's time to preserve, you know, our energy to prepare what's upcoming. Uh, woman. 我自己人生的过程 我们人生走过的这个弯路良师益友达到这个切磋 uh, um, So, uh, Venerable Chanda, uh, he's um, 
you know, when he was in uh, age of 20, in his you know, youth, in 20s, he has a lot of questions, uh, seeking answers, but he couldn't find it. Uh, but after encountering the wisdom, you know, the 5,000 years of accumulated wisdom in uh, traditional Chinese uh, culture and texts, and also Master Jin Kong, uh, he ma- managed to pull through, pull, uh, pull himself through this um, how do I say, uh, period of confusion. And uh, because why do we rely on this, Be- on the wisdom of the you know, sages, of the ancestors? Because they have gone through what we have gone through. And they are like, a, uh, like an experience, also a cautionary tale, you know, what not to do, what to do, so that we don't have to repeat the same mistakes again, right? Those who fail to remember history are bound to repeat it again. Um, also, uh, we are not alone. Another key message from Venerable is we are not alone in this journey called life. And because we have first the wisdoms of the sages in the past, right? So to speak, the sages, the Buddha, the uh, Confucius, Lao, Lao Tzu, and also wisdoms of our ancestors, you know, our parents, our great grandparents. And also we have each other, friends, teachers, friends, family, uh, brothers and sisters. Um, so please be free, open your heart, open your, open your mind, like feel free to talk about what's troubling you uh, in an orderly manner. Uh, uh, feel free to share uh, what's troubling you um, in the form of questions. Uh, as we heard a, clause, a beauty in the eyes of beholder, people who sees, um, you know, people who's, who, it's based on what we experience, right? We see what we experience. Uh, um, so so um, feel free to share what's what the questions you have in your mind and bring out here we'll, 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 we'll you know share our experience, our perspective with each other. Okay. Kenny has a questions about uh, Buddhist practice cult- uh, cultivation. The first one is he has the um, Jin Gang Jin Diamond Sutra. Um, and he has been diligently uh, chanting the um, sutra of uh, Diamond Sutra. Uh, can he go to Pure Land with this uh, merit? And second question is Leng Yan Sutra. Uh, he also cultivated uh, uh, earnestly on the uh, teachings of uh, the Leng Yan Sutra. Uh, sorry, I forgot the Sanskrit word, but um, same question as well. Uh, can he uh, achieve the merits to go to Pure Land with that? How? Oh. 這個首先我們能不能往生啊,我們依照經典的教會來思維。whether we can go to pure land, uh, it, for, it, it depends on how well we follow the mindset taught by the sutra. 我們都是依照經典,而不是我們本來容易產生的擔憂。So it's based on the sutra's teaching, not our worries that produce in our mind. 我們學佛啊,是心去做佛。所以我們學佛的過程呢,也是改心,改性格。when we practice Buddhism, how, what do we use to become Buddhist, Buddha? We use our heart to become Buddha. We transform our attitude, our heart. That's how we become Buddha. For example, our uh, original state, as in uh, original attitude, is we l- we easily worried. So this will translate in your Buddhist cultivation. We become, you know, worried whether we can go to Pure Land when we pro- uh, we when we cultivate Buddhism. Ah, so we are practicing. Ah, first, we need to follow the teaching of the Holy Buddha, the Buddhist teaching, not follow some of our habits. 
to learn this path of sages, to learn to be enlightened, we need to first follow the teaching of the sages, of these people who are enlightened, not our existing um, wandering thoughts and afflictions and troubles. So, knowing that uh, principle, now if we talk about pure land, if we want to go to pure land, we should follow the mindset, the system structure of pure land sutras. Only then we have a clear idea how to go to pure land. Um, as what the Infinite Life Sutra have said, the uh, upper level of attainment in of reborn in Pure Land or middle level or the lower level attainment, they all rely on uh, first invoking the Buddha and the body vow. And then second, one mindedness, one heartedness, a uh, single mindedness on the chanting of Amitofo. Uh, uh, the name of Amitofo. Yeah. Oh, uh, the standard set by the Amitabha Buddha himself is uh, to uh, use our sincere most sincere, most earnest, most concentrated mind on the name of Amitofo. In summary, it's called uh, uh, faith, confidence, uh, vow, and, and, and action. Yeah. Oh, that Guan Wu Liang Shou Jing is teaching us to show Jing Ye Shan Fu, especially the first Fu. 孝养父母, 奉师师长, 慈心不杀, Another sutra, a uh, pure sutra, is the um, sutra of um, ob observing the infinite uh, life uh, Buddha, Guang uh, Wuliangso, is um, to cultivate the merits, the three foundational merits. The first foundational merit is to be filial to your parents. Uh, love and respect your parents. Uh, listen to the teachings of your elders and teachers. Uh, be compassionate by not killing, and uh, and and cultivate the ten virtuous um, meritorious uh, deeds. Uh,因为今夜三伏第一伏做到了，就是阿弥陀经里面讲的善男子善女人了，你就符合这个资格了。uh, as we're familiar with the sutra's uh, uh, wording, uh, kind um, practitioners, uh, kind male practitioner, kind female practitioners, kind to be qualified as kind in Buddhist standard, one must um, attain at least the first foundational uh, merits, which is what we mentioned before, be respect and respect your parents, yeah, etc. Now, this person, he... 提到了他修学的方式呢，是《金刚经》念三部，啊，还有念《楞严咒》，啊，那他这个修持呢，是属于啊持大乘经典，啊，那这个是属于《无量寿经》里面讲的，若有众生住大乘者，以清净心向无量
，那你离我相了，那就等于是你要在一切境界当中啊，把自私自利要放下，啊，而不断放淡，不是说你马上放下，要放淡，啊，它是种人我的对立啊，要放下来，啊，包含你看一切众生呢、啊，失落自己。这个是人相啊，你就慢慢就能够比较淡了。好、哦，其实主要是从你一个有这个我了，他就有人跟众生的对待了。哦，那受者这样就是时间的一个执着了。哎，好、哦，所以你对时空这个执着呢，慢慢放淡啊、哦，对人我跟众生的这个对待。能够慢慢放淡，哦，都是都是爱一切人，都是理净一切物，哦，哎，这个就是把事项啊慢慢放淡了，哦，那些跟《金刚经》的教诲就比较能相应了。啊，感恩师父。阿弥陀佛，阿弥陀佛。呃 ，as um， 呃 ，as 呃呃。Our、uh, brother Kenny has、uh, mentioned about this.、Um, Venerable say,、um, if he he's practicing diamond based on the Mahayana Sutra, Diamond Sutra, uh, uh, Diamond Sutra, and also chanting the、uh, mantra of Leng Yan. And this is、um, a Mahayana teaching. And in the Infinite Life Sutra, they did mention those who practice the Mahayana teaching. That means they follow the teachings of Mahayana、um, path. Uh, as long as they dedicate,、uh, you know, all their merits towards the pure land, they shall be reborn in pure land.、Um, and、uh, Kenny has、uh, follow up and saying that what he learned、uh, from the Diamond Sutra and you know caught his attention the most is the four, you know, leaving the four、um, attachments, four attachments of forms, the idea of ourself, myself, the idea of others. The idea of the world, 众生 the idea of the of the the world, you know, things that form due to condition, and the last one is the idea of time. So, the ego, myself, others, the world, and the and the time. So these are the uh, um, how to say the mindset, the path laid down by uh the teachings of in of uh Diamond Sutra, and um. It all came from the attachment of the idea of self, false, false sense of self.、Uh, once we let go of these attachments、uh, of ego,、uh, we will be able to fully, you know, treat others as if it's ourself. Be fully compassionate, be fully respect, like really respect people, really love people,、uh, and and so on, so on. So following this kind of mindset, your mentality aligns with the teaching of Pure Land. And that's why you'll be able to go to pure land. Middle four. Oh, 那修学大乘哈、哦，呃，《华严经》里面有讲，佛法无人说，虽至莫能解。啊，所以受持大乘经典呢，啊，那要有名师来指导。啊，所以建议这一位忍者能够听净空老和尚啊讲《金刚经》。哦，那他他在。听的过程呢，哎，就懂得把《金刚经》能落实在生活、工作、处事、待人、接物当中，哦，而且他这么年轻就很重视修行哈，这个是很难得的善根啊。那当然，修行啊，也不是一触可及啊，所以我们在修的过程呢，也不能着急啊。哎，所以这个心也要能。啊，调伏啊，要要稳扎稳扎，步步为营啊，这这个修行是急不来的。好，感恩师傅，感恩师傅。Thank you, everyone. Ah,、uh, thank you, Venerable. Ah,、uh, thank you, Kenny. So we have um, a Venerable ah、uh, say as per、uh, Flower Adornment Sutra, you know, one of the big Mahayana Sutra. Ah,、uh, this ah,、uh, there is a saying in there, um, that Buddhism. Right needs to be preached by people. It needs to be thought. It needs to be shared by people. 
Otherwise, even though you have, uh, you might, we might have all the smarts and intelligence in the world, but if we haven't encountered these teachings, right, through the sharing of others, we will never be able to uh, break, uh, be enlightened, be aware of the reality. So we need to, you know, vigorously share the teachings. Um, also, um, venerable, uh, you know, kindly av- uh, advice, uh, Kenny, to uh, try a uh, 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 look up. Uh, on Venerable Master Ching Kong's uh, teaching on YouTube or any uh, other medias. Um, yeah, but uh, remember, uh, this, it's such a, it, it's such a, how to say, fortunate thing to be able to learn Buddhism at such a young age. Uh, and, and however, we should be steady, uh, not rushing our progress um, so that we actually achieve long-term, uh, uh, you know, Results, yeah, not falling off halfway. Uh, there is a question from Joanne. In a very uh, day-to-day uh, life, which is busy and hectic, you know, for all all peoples of all age, the elder, um, the uh, age people, the younger people, uh, and the elderly people, how do we invoke the body vow and stay concentrated on reciting Amitofo? That's question number one. Number two, if we do not invoke a body vow, a body heart, sorry, a body heart, can we go to Pure Land by just chanting Amitofo? Can we even have any results chanting Amitofo? Amitofo. Oh. Uh, uh, 这个我们处在这个繁忙的生活环境啊, 比古代更不容易了那首先呢我们接触佛法我们要了解到啊佛开悟的第一句话一切众生呢皆具如来智慧德相但以妄想执着啊不能证得那佛开悟的一句话其实就是他四十九年教导的总纲领了那我们从这一句话就体会到我们本来是否一切众生皆具如来智慧德相那我本来是否我不恢复我本有的佛性那就变成是自己糟蹋自己了自己愿意往受这个轮回的痛苦了所以真正明白自己本来是否那要发菩提心就不难了因为我尊重自己的佛性了嘛那我也了解到一切众生是否我也了解到一切众生像这个梵王菩萨戒经说的一切男子是我父一切女人是我母那我明白这个真相了那我们众生无边誓愿度这个心就不难发出来了所以你明理了就容易发出来了 So the first one is uh, in response to the question the current society it's um, harder in terms of you know uh, it's harder for us to cultivate compared to the people in the um, ancient times because it is more uh, high efficient, high demand and it's busier. So um, the first word we learn from you know Buddha's uh, story uh, is all sentient beings, all beings have the same uh, wisdom merits like the Buddha. But because of uh, wandering thoughts, because of afflictions, they were not able to attain the same level as the Buddha. If uh, we recognize ourselves, our Buddha nature, you know, everyone is a Buddha. 
uh, we lost it uh, in our thoughts, wandering thoughts. If we don't, um, you know, allowing ourselves, you know, to open to this reality, we are denying a chance for us to um, live freely, a bigger, bigger life, you know, a, a better life. Uh, is a wasted opportunity. However, if we acknowledge that we are, you know, originally Buddha, we have Buddha nature, uh, we are able to take the stances of uh, all, uh, we're able to see the world from what an enlightened being sees, which is all sentient beings, right? All uh, men are my father, all women are my mother or my family. You're able to uh, treat them with kind and love as you would to your own family. 可是我们要把它恢复啊说的，须臾被念佛之心，刹那即结轮回业之所。那有这个体会了，那就不敢不好好念佛啊，不不愿意打妄想啊。哎，嗯，so um, um, now the other question is how. Right, since invoking body vows is important, how do we invoke it? How do we bring it out? How do we invoke that, you know, the, the body heart? First, we need to use a method called chanting Amitofo to awake that nature that is already in us, that Buddha hood that is already in us, the ability to awaken that is already in us. Also, um, that way we can uh, replace, you know, more the more time we spend on chanting Amitofo, the less time we uh, allowing ourselves, you know, lost in the wandering thoughts. Also, I mean, everyone's familiar with Tri's Yearning Ceremony. And in there, we sing about uh, a clause like this. One uh, sesutna, you know, one sesutna or one slither of moments of forgetting uh, to chant Amitabha, uh, or forgetting the name of Amitabha, Buddha. We immediately creates the six rims in our mind again and again. So that the moment we do not put our mind on Amitofo, we immediately create the, the scenario of six rims at that very moment. So that's how, how minute the differences is between awakened and lost. Uh, 我们这个菩提心要保持啊家庭生活当中
去生活处事，那我们就变成造造轮回业了。哦，所以我们在跟家人相处，我们是造轮回业，还是在积功累德？啊，我们在工作当中是在造轮回业，还是积功累德？啊，关键就是我们有没有用真心了。哦，那你平常不念佛啊？你真正跟人家一相处，那个脾气上来了，你怎么用真心啊？哦，可是你平常常念佛了，哦，你平常就念佛，你突然有情绪上来啊，哎，你很容易关照，啊，很可能佛号啊，就把这个情绪本来调下去了。好 ，Thank you. So, um. Body heart uh, to maintain it is an entirely、uh, different matter.、Um, without, to be honest, practically speaking, like as in you know, when you practice body on the ground and test it, chanting Amitabha is the easiest way to maintain that body heart. You know, the the state of、uh, clarity without the muddy wandering thoughts, because without chanting Amitabha, we would definitely give rise to a lot of Thinking, minds, you know, a lot of thoughts,、um, and we might get lost into it、uh, if we attach to it and stuff. So,、um, in the other word, in other words, we want to maintain a a heart of sincerity, of genuine, you know, of pu- uh, uh, a purity,、uh, a, a sincere heart. Okay, and using the sincere heart, this kind of sincereness in dealing with our day to day. Is very crucial.、Um, in Buddhism, we always have what is the main practice course. You know, for us pra- practitioners of the Pure Land School, is the Chan Am Metaphor. That's the main、uh, course. The elective course, so to speak, the side course, all right, or side dish, appetizer, is to、uh, do good deeds. You know, volunteer, help people. Uh, you know, give them a smile or anything, anything that is in accordance to your pure heart, the heart of kindness, the heart of sincerity. Because、um, of that, you were able to build a momentum, and you able to maintain that, you know, the vow of,、uh, you know, to go to pure land. And、uh, venerable also mentioned, what happened if we do not chant Amitabha for, is that we can't control our Temper, when things happen in front of you, you get angry instinctively. You, you, things doesn't go your way, you get angry. And with the habit of chanting Amitabha, you're able to, you will still have anger and all that 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 is already there. But you're able to see it. You're able to have more opportunity to you know, figure out what is that. And you, once you get used to figuring out what is that, and when you put yourself to the ground, face to face with the real life, you're able to, you know, not get overwhelmed by anger as easily as people who does not practice chanting Amitabha or meditation. Amitabha. Yesterday, a student asked, "How can the elder brothers practice Amitabha? How can they practice?" 哎，跟我们这个发菩提心一项专念呢，这个还是很相关。啊，处事啊，也用菩提心去处处理事情。啊，那如何念佛啊？所以这一段法语啊，呃，知道的呃忍者可以把这一段发上来啊，这样大家都看得到。好，而这一句法语啊，其实就包含了一切境界的。啊，我们没有事的时候啊，那我们要把佛号提起来，这是老和尚教我们的哈、啊。而且提起来，我们要会念啊。那我们真的要办事了啊，我我要很好的去思维了啊，去关照了。那我可以先把佛号放下来，但是我还是用真心在处理事情。好、啊，那。这这一段先翻好了。好
Um, there's another question from a uh, uh, from another uh, practitioner, uh, and she said, uh, "How to, to chant Ami Tofu? How to how chant Ami Tofu, or how to uh, manage daily affairs? You know, like um, the Master Xia Lianju. You know, Mister Xia. He is a very famous uh, practitioner in the uh, earliest nationalist era. Um, and Venerable say it." Uh, We'll share a clause of his um, teachings when uh, after this. Uh, so what he said essentially means that when you have nothing to do, you're free of your obligations, chant Amitofo. And no, uh, Master Ching Kong also mentioned need to know how to chant Amitofo. You know, you know, no wandering thoughts, no mixing in with other uh, thoughts. And we, when you're dealing with your daily affairs, your, your day-to-day business, you need to... Um, Use sincerity, you know. Be genuine. Be sincere in in in, in dealings of people of things. Uh, only then you have that kind of a right mindset, right condition uh, to um, move towards the pure land. Oh, that of course, young, middle-aged, old-aged, they face the life and work situation is a bit different. 所以老人呢、啊，可能就是要放得下啊，儿孙自有儿孙福，不要乱操心。嗯<笑>、um, ，Of course, when we talk about daily affairs, it's uh, it's very different for different people. To make it easier for us to understand, uh, youth, uh, people who is in the uh, mid age and people who are uh elder elderly, they have different. Uh, things they have to encounter, they have to deal with. For elderly people, the most important thing they need to uh, be aware of is the attachments to their young ones, to their loved ones, their uh, children's grandchildrens. Uh, there's a saying that the you know younger generations have their own merits and faults. You know we need to uh, let them you know, figure it out themselves. Uh, don't overly uh, overcompensate over. Uh, involve in their life, you know. They have their own path to thread, so to speak, as you did. So right now, you, you, your focus is to let go of the attachments. That this sentence of Chinese includes all the blessings. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of Buddhism, to actually let go of the attachments. Ah, we don't need to pray, we don't need to deal with things. That reminds us to use the first principle of
，因为起了这些念头啊，你就有分别执着，就有烦恼了，就流入第二念了。啊，是第一念是智慧，第二念就是情势的，啊，就是分别执着了。啊，你随自己的分别执着就染污了。啊，你依照智慧，慢慢就越来越清净了。啊，你随着一句一句老实念的，心就会慢慢静下来。阿弥陀佛。嗯、um, ，So this is a clause. Ah,、uh, Venerable is explaining the clause from Ah、uh, Master Xia Lianju. Ah,、uh, Mr. Xia. Ah,、uh, he has such a very good, ah,、uh, you know, simple yet deep, um, methods to help us to get to the state of invoking body hearts. So how it goes is the basic principle is、um, no matter you're chanting, you know the things you're doing, chanting Amitabha, or deal with your daily affairs, you know daily business. Always use the first thought, not the second thought. So what does that mean? When you chant Amitabha, scenario number one, chant Amitabha, everything you do not need to、uh, put in your heart other than the name of Amitabha. Every Sentence "A Mi To Fo" has to be cleared,、uh, has to be, you know, follow the、uh, the rhythm as is. You know, don't add, don't 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 reduce as is. You know, it is what it is as is, and chant earnestly. Just be there. Don't think about the past, present, future. Don't think about this and that. Just "A Mi To Fo," and that's what uh, Master uh, Xia means by. First thought. Follow your first thought. And、uh, venerable also <clears throat> expanded on this、um, second sentence. If so, that's a negative example. If we are trying to act, act diligent, jing. So acting as as if I'm a very good practitioner. You know, I'm very highly trained. So there is a sense of hypocrity, hypocrity,、uh, being hypocrite. You know, being. Trying to show off, yes. If there is a thought of showing off, <clears throat> or if there is a thought of rushing, when when am I going to meet Amitabha? Or when can I attain enlightenment? Or so if you find yourself in the state of trying to show off that you are good practitioners, or in the state of、uh, you know looking at your clock and say when can I meet Amitabha, or、uh, you know keep asking when can I attain enlightenment? Please tell me. This is are not. A mindset that helps you to actually achieve the targets to 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 pure land. Also,、uh, Master Xia go further and say,、uh, if we are asking for miracles, like oh, please show me some you know special effects,、uh, the special uh, 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 situation in in my mind, so that I have confidence. Do not ask for that. Also, if we、um, you know trying to accumulate. You know, like tally, tally up, trying to say, oh yes, you know,、uh, how much I have accumulated. You know,、uh, trying to say, how can I speed this up? That kind of mindset is also against、uh, achieving pure land. Last one is also surprise to me. <laughs> Close your mind from the world, right?、Um, that means you shut your mind and say, I'm not gonna worry about the world, man. So I'm just gonna focus on Amitabha. I don't care about the world. The mindset of I don't care is also against chanting Amitabha, against achieving、um, uh, pure land. So these negative scenarios are what Master Xia meant by second thoughts. Thank you. Oh, that. 处理事情啊、哦，这是就这两件事嘛，要不念佛，要不处理事情啊。哦我们就是大公无私去做，好，那事情来了，我们就真心的去面对它，啊，这个事情还没来啊，好，我们不要去担心，好，好，不用不用去挂碍这个事情，啊，因为老和尚常常说，用心如镜。哎，真心像镜子，这个境界还没来，他这个镜子不不不会在那里担心，啊，这个境界走了
镜子也不会把它留在镜子上面，留在心上。哎，这个可以用用心如镜啊，来体会一下，就是事未至啊，勿将也。事已过了，事情过了，就不会还留在心上了，勿留至的。啊，然后就坦坦荡荡。然后心呢，都是放空的，空才会灵啊。你心里很多事啊，事情一来，你你头昏脑胀的，你很难处理好的。哦，所以能够大公无私哦，然后进来不拒，进去不留啊，这个就是用第一念的。但是若是呢？我们在面对事的时候啊，哎，我们的心产生了计较啊，谁对谁错啊，人我是非了，好、哦，跟人对立了，啊、哦，或者是呢，沾故得失啊，就是我们有患得患失的心呢、啊，去处理事的，或者呢，我们感情用事的，或者我们情绪。脾气、意气用事的，这样就流露啊。第二念啊，第一念是理智，第二念呢、啊、是随顺我们的欲望了啊,啊。你随顺欲望了啊,啊，随顺这种得失心啊啊，随顺这种呃感情意气了。那你看什么事情就暗，就是看不清楚了，啊，都被自己的欲望、情情绪啊障碍住了，啊，但是你循着这个理智了，你看事情就明白了。阿弥陀佛，谢谢师父。Uh, thank you, Venerable. Um, so, Venerable continues with the clause, second half. Sorry, I have left out the conclusion of first. So, basically, follow the first thought is wisdom. Follow the second thought is differentiation. We call it mind, you know, differentiation. Follow the wisdom, we pure. Follow the differentiation, the mind is impure. That means we get more troubled, more um, more worries. So the second half of the sentence goes like this: When we encounter matters, right? So the first half talks about when we chant Amitabha. Second half talks about the scenario of dealing with everything, you know, your everything, everyday stuff. So because there's only two things in our world: one is when we cultivate during quiet, when nothing happens. Second one is when we have things going on arise in our in front of us, we have to deal with them. So, with or without. Matters, right? So, second scenario: when we deal with our daily affairs, you know, use the most、um, ordinary mindset.、Um, uh, use the mindset of mirrors. So, how does that work? Be like the mirror, because mirror, when nothing appears in front of it, is not going to worry about when is it going to come in front of me. It's just a mirror, empty as a mirror, clear as a mirror, pure as a mirror. When matters affected, that means matters appears in front of the mirror. The mirror do not say, "I don't like this. I like this." The mirror is just a mirror. A mirror reflects what's in front of the mirror. It shows as is the matter as it is.、Uh, it does not trying to color anything on top of it. So, this is how we should approach things, or things approach us. What we should do.、Um, When we, it has not come, we do not allow. I mean, we do not give rise to any wandering thoughts. We just be natural, you know. Just try me tofu if you can, and keep our mind pure and empty. When matters、uh, approach us,、uh, do not hesitate. Do not, you know, over worry, over, over.、Um, how to say troubled? Look into the issue in the eye of the issue,、um, and. Deal with it accordingly. That's that kind of state of mind is the first thought.、Um, however, if 
we give rise to um no before that if we let our mind empty our 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 you know this one empty not as uh, muddied muddied with a lot of thoughts then um it's what we call aware right you're aware because you are not coloring your lenses with a lot of uh prejudices or stuff like that you're you're clear that's how you become aware smart so how on the other hand if we start to give rise to who's right who's wrong you know judgmental it's trying to you know be a judge you know or if we trying to say oh how much did i gain oh no how much did i lost you know gain and lost and worst case if you involve emotions i hate this i love this i really need this i don't want this so you like or dislike you know, you love you hate or you give rise to anger or give rise to lust or give rise to anything that is you know disturbing your mind then it's called the second thought so in summary first thought is rational is clarity second thought is desires is it's yeah it's desires it's yearning and your uh, hey and couple hey and an oh uh, if we follow our desire it's i mean everything is dark muddy unclear if we follow our um you know our rationality our um peace of mind you know our uh clear mind then everything becomes clear apparent as is那当然哈这个念佛处事用第一念呢也不是我们一用就能达到这样的效果啊它一定有一个过程啊我们也是在念佛跟处理事的过程呢能够关照到啊我有得失心了啊我有求快的心了啊不怕念起只怕觉此
So how do I um, avoid myself falling into th- to the um, to the mindset of hey um, I close my mind like is it is it the same thing as focusing on um, is focusing on army tofu the same as not worrying about anything going on outside? Chisuman 对你自己的心也是一个干扰你自己感受到了你就会更愿意就是老老实实一句一字一句就好别搞复杂了你就会有身心的受用了 um, So uh, in response to my question Venerable say that the um the, the principle of able to recite Amitofo well is be clear on every sentence, be chant and be present. The question, the issues of, you know, having the thought of I don't care or I don't want anything else disturbing me when I chanting Amitofo itself is a disturbance uh, from us focusing on the name of Amitabha. So it's very subtle. Um, but we need to pay attention to the subtle difference on this. Uh, the the basic principle is don't complicate it, don't overthink it, don't over, don't try to add things on top of it or not add things on top of it. Let the not not add things on top of it. It's um, it's it's all detrimental to our practice. Uh, in uh, you know, achieving one high one mindedness on Amitofo. Thank you, Venerable. Um, anyone else have any questions, guys? Like, you know, it doesn't have to be, you know, like Buddhism, Buddhism, it can be daily life, you know, everything, you know, time you and the thing you the thing you eat, the thing you see, even relationships. You know, right. So don't forget we have Venerable Chanda here. He's yeah, very wise. Oh, that's a good 看你实际的情况比方说你发觉你念了出现忘念了你能提醒自己专注在佛号上把它拉回来因为出现忘念太正常了你只要不那个忘念越来越厉害就好你能把它拉回来慢慢慢慢你就比较能拉得回来方法就是我们可以念佛听经读经拜佛这些修行的方法可以适当的运用一下尤其这个听经你越明白这一句万德洪明的受用对你自己的利益
那这个就你可以，就是你念的时候有妄念，这个是很正常哈。这个我们平常心去对待，好，然后可以不断的提醒自己，还是拉回来，字句分明。啊，假如效果不是很好，也可以调整一下。哎，我现在听经的话比较容易专注，啊，哎，我听一段时间再来念。啊，或者我读一一段《无量寿经》啊，我再来念啊，这个是可以调整的啊。只要是忆佛、念佛，啊，你在读经的时候是是在读这个西方极乐世界阿弥陀佛的庄严呢、啊，菩萨的庄严呢、啊，整个西方极乐世界的庄严呢、啊，啊，你这个都是属于忆佛了。你只要是忆佛念佛啊，那你就是在道中了，哎，都对于我们呢修行有很大的帮助啊！忆佛念佛可以现前当来的，啊，只要让我们忆佛念佛的功夫啊，能够不断提升啊，就很好。好、啊，这这个看自己啊，怎么来运用。Thank you so much,、uh, Venerable Tanda. Thank you, Sally.、Um, so,、uh, in response to Sally's question, Venerable、uh, re responded with, "It's normal. It's very normal to have、uh, wandering thoughts as long as、uh, we're alive. The key is to able to pull back as soon as possible, not wandering too far you know, from our、um, concentration, from our amitofo. However, there are scenarios where we can't stop ourselves." From overthinking, from you know falling into that, you know loop, you know from the thoughts overpowering our concentration our, on Amitofo, we can use different methods. You know there are many strategies, and one of them is to prostrate to Buddha, listen to the Dharma, listen to the talks、uh, from like the venerables,、um, tailor it according to our condition. Tailor it to to the condition we are facing at the moment. Say if you don't find yourself able to focus、uh, at all, you know, just go ahead and do some exercise. Do the、um, prostration to the Buddha as an exercise, all right? Until you're ready, you know, your your mind is back to normal a little bit. Then you start listening to the sutra, uh, uh, the Dharma, and then slowly back to the Amitofo chanting. It it's flexible. As long as you follow,、um, you're able to achieve these two targets. First is to remember about Buddha or the, the Buddha's pure land. You know the the because we all read in Final Sutra, we can remember our we can visualize like how the pure land is made. You know the seven jewels, trees, and、uh, eight meritorious、uh, ponds.、Um, you know all the things that was described. You know vividly in the sutra, we can use that tool. To help us remember about Buddha and his pure land, or think about Buddha by chanting his name. As long as we're able to achieve these two targets, then we're still,、uh, you know, able to control our wandering thoughts. Yeah, returning back to our pure mind. 那我们这个念佛啊，分几种方式啊、呃？有，当然十相念佛这个太高了，我们一下子办不到。啊、呃，有观相啊，你盯盯着一个相念佛啊，观相念佛，还有观想啊，你你去想啊，这个极乐世界一正庄严观想，还还有第四个是持名念佛，哦，所以我们假如是专一持名念佛。那当然，主要的就是支持这个名号，字句分明的来念，这个以这个为主了。啊，你要在这个字句分明当中啊，功夫不断提升。好，但也有可能，比方你在念的时候，可能妄念，你你起来了。好，哎，假如这个时候你。字句分明就拉回来了，啊，挺好的
，啊，假如这个时候拉不回来，哎，你观想，啊，比方说这个极乐世界土，你一观想这个境呢，哎，你很容易就把那个妄念拉回来，好，那这个可以用一下，啊，但是你还是以持名念佛为主。啊，比方说，我念着持名念佛，我感觉我好像妄念起起起来，有点拉不回来了。啊，我就观想阿弥陀佛，黄金币昼夜长垂在我面前要接我了。啊，我一想那个感觉，好像那个念佛的恳切就会比较拉回来了。那我就继续老是在念佛了。啊，就是主办圆融啊，主一定是。持名念佛，因为这是我们主修的方方方式方法了。其他的可以，假如说用一下可以帮助我们，那这个用一下是没有问题。啊，但是这个主次啊，这个还是要清楚的。刚刚刚呢有提到说哦，我们可以用这个念佛、读经、听经。拜佛这些修行的手段，来调整自己的状态，甚至包含呢，你去服务大众，也是一种调整的状态。啊，因为往往我们烦恼起来的时候啊，都跟我有关，我贪我嗔我吃我慢。哎，这个时候你去服务别人，你很愿意。哎，你可能在做的过程呢、啊，本来心情不大好，做着做着，你心情就转过来了。哦，就是这些方法，就看你自己的状况了，可以很灵活的来运用调整。阿弥陀佛，我们听经的目的啊，也是为了明理，啊，也是为了呢，对这一句佛号啊，更有信心。那你，我们说信解行证呢、啊？你听经是解呀、啊，解了之后要行啊。好，那就要发菩提心，一向专念了、啊。好，而当我们花更多的时间在念佛的时候，啊，我们自己感觉、啊，哎，我的烦恼少了，啊，我的智慧提升了。那这个这个就很有受用了，所以师父领进门呢，修行要靠个人自己去检查了。啊，比方说我念佛多了，可是我妄念没有减少，啊，我在境界当中处理事啊，啊，还是很多烦恼跟情绪，好，那可能我们还要再多听一点经，啊，因为听了经呢，明了理呀、啊。在处理事的时候呢，能够用听的这些教理啊，来调伏这些烦恼啊。哎，假如我佛号越念越多，我处理事情呢也越来越多，用对心啊，都处理的好。那当然，佛号越念越多啊，那这个也是很很好的。很有受用的，好、哦，所以这个还得自己检查一下自己的状态。好，阿弥陀佛，阿弥陀佛，感恩师父。So the first response for the first question、um, is the you know、um, what should we do right in concentrating on the four characters or should we visualize the Buddha himself and the pure land?、Um, there are four levels of cultivating. Pure land. The first one, the highest one, is very hard to do, which is, you know, basically like Zen master, discern things as is. 思想念佛 literally, yeah, it's something we can't achieve、um, for most people. And the second one is we uh, 师傅那个思想念佛下面是观相和观想是吗？观相啊，你你有一个一个相一直看，叫观相念佛。再讲一次 ，visualizing， 然后第三个是观想。观想，哎，你自己想象啊，这个世界
对 ，OK， 好，师傅，谢谢。So, um, the first one is discern the reality as is when you chant. Uh, that's the first level of pure land practice. Second one is to visualize the pure land, uh, the Buddha, the pure land. The third one is to imagine, you know, a certain a point, you know, in this as per the sutra. The third, the fourth one is to chant the name of、uh, Amitofo. Uh, which is what we used to do. So here's how we do it. If visualization of pure land can help, use it. If it gives you a booster, you know, it helps you to pull yourself back from these seas of wandering thoughts, back to your, you know, most sincere, most pure, and most calm self、uh, center. Use it. However, there's a matter of main dish and side dish, as we mentioned earlier. So what is the main? What is the side? You know, once the main, once the auxiliary. So the main will always be、uh, chanting the name of Amitofo. It's the most accessible way,、uh, easiest to remember. You know, that's that's what we follow by. You know, so once we stabilize, you know, ourselves, you know, from drowning into the sea of wandering thoughts, so to speak, we immediately switch on the main gear and go back to Amitofo chanting. Uh, so it's a very flexible thing. We just need to know which one is the main, you know, main dish or main path, so to speak,、uh, which is the chanting of the Amitabha's name, Ami Tofo.、Uh, if we have、uh, more wandering thoughts, it's overpowering. It does not work. Then use visualization、uh, as you wish, you know,、uh, as you see fit. Yeah, it's a very flexible thing.、Uh, also, we just talk about, you know, the Primary and secondary, right?、Um, primary is chanting Amitabha. Secondary is use the sincere heart, use the sincere heart to treat people, to treat, be sincere with people, be sincere with your task at hand, your responsibility, etc. In relationship, etc. Another way is you can use servicing, volunteering. You know, service the public、uh, as a way、um, to help you. You know, get back on track、uh, because you feel more.、Uh, Lighter and happier as you、uh, connect with people through, you know, service them.、Um, you might be angry one day, you know, drown in your anger, drown in your sorrowness, etc., or depression and stuff like that. But you, if you're able to,、uh, you know, use this opportunity、uh, in, say, volunteering a communities and stuff, you know, be part of a community. It helps you to go back on track. You feel lighter, happier, and ha- thus you'll be a- you'll be able to go back. To your main main path, which is chanting Amitofo. So that's the first、um, answer for the first question. So the second response to the second question, which is, should I listen more to sutra or should I chant Amitofo?、Um, which one is more important? So venerable goes by this. The whole point of sutra listening, you know, why do we listen to the Dharma? Is to understand what's going on. Why are we doing this? You know why is this happening? How do we get along with this? How how, how do we manage this issue, this problem, you know, this this emotions, these scenarios? So it it helps us to understand. And after understanding, we need to practice, put it in action, to act, to do it. You know, for us, we chant Amitofo. For us, we cultivate the three meritorious deeds,、uh, the three foundational、uh, merits.、Um, These two help each other, and we need to、uh, understand this、um, concept, you know, of education in Buddhism. So the teacher lead you through the doorsteps. They guide you where to go, but the act of going relies on yourself and only yourself. You need to be able to walk to the door, even though the teacher point the door to you. It's not going to work if you're not walking to the door. So. Using that principle, put it in daily life. Say, example:、um, if our anger is still heavy, or desire, lust, etc., all this、uh, great hatred, ignorance is very strong. We can,、uh, even though we have been earnestly chanting Amitabha for every day, it's time to go back to say Master Ching Kong's teaching. Just sit down and listen to his teaching again. You know, listen to his. Teaching again, so that we can get a deeper understanding of what he meant. You know, we, he might repeat 
it, uh, you might hear this many times, but this time you have different scenario and it might reflect a different uh, perspective for you so that you open, you know. So then you can go back to Amitofo. Or the other hand, if chanting Amitofo helps you to concentrate better at your work, use it. So use this understanding and action side by side right, at, as you see fit. Amitofo. Oh, we uh, have half an hour left. Anyone uh, has any questions uh, like regarding young people? This uh, Yemeo 他现在希望能多得一些财富这个问题那我们呢可以跟他交流到古代的财神是谁那现在最有钱的是谁可以跟他交流一下古代呢财神是 陶朱公辦理他為什麼那麼有錢好那現在呢老和尚在講經的時候啊有提過李嘉誠好好你看李嘉誠工作很認真啊有沒有人比他認真呢可能有啊但是不見得有錢哦所以關鍵呢是李嘉诚本身的财库是满出来的他有一个老师叫陈朗在他很年轻的时候问他说你想多少钱呢他说我三千万就好了他说不值你看那么年轻就已经看出来他以后那么有钱了所以啊这个有没有钱呢修来的不
改变命运啊，你给他现身说法，哦，那是更有力力量了。<笑>好，哦，那这个是针对财富啊来回答，但另外一个重点呢、啊，你可以问他，哎，你这么想追求到财富的目的是什么？真的有钱人就幸福吗？啊，你有没有去观察过？现在是有钱人得忧郁症的多，还是没钱的人得忧郁症的多呢？啊，这又是另外一个问题了。就是他的追求，他为什么想有钱？那你假如是希望跟人家比了，那完蛋了，这个继续下去啊，一定越来越痛苦的。人比人气死人了。哦，这个是可以延伸出来啊，哎，真正的快乐啊，不是你获得多少，不是拥有的多，是计较的少，是感恩的多啊。所以快乐是从内而外出来的，这是真的快乐。从外面，这个都叫刺激啊，哎，刺激一下，就好像吸毒一样，刺激一下，嗯，好像舒服了。但长时间又痛苦了，哦，所以我们别搞那个要用欲望刺激我们的那种快乐哦，那个会越陷越深。所以现在的人忧郁症越来越多了。你看人拼命赚钱了，为什么后面结果是这样？这个值得我们深思了。啊，努力有结果啊，不一定会有好结果，一定要努力的方向要正确。好，阿弥陀佛。Uh, Amitu Four, thank you, uh, Venerable, and thank you, uh, uh, Brother uh, Hook. So now we have to um, now we have a question about wealth, right? We all like trying to work so hard over time, try to get money, and a lot of people are stressed for money.、Um, so for those of us who have opportunity to learn Buddhism,、um, we know that the cause and effect of wealth. Uh, so, how do we help people around us、uh, to gain wealth, to understand the meaning of wealth,、uh, to reduce the stress, essentially, you know, lighten their load? So, venerable、uh, goes with,、um, you know, even young adult nowadays, they all have careers, fami- family to,、um, you know, on their shoulders. It still、uh, does not leave the cultivation part out of their life. In fact, they need it more.、Uh, one might argue.、Um, Like what we talk about the first thought, if we use the sincere heart to deal with others, you know, to deal with the jobs at hand, to deal with people around us,、uh, to 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 treat them like you know sincerely,、uh, that's how we should、uh, go about in our cultivation. Another question is、um, wealth, right? If people, if you want to, you know, spread it to the people around you,、um, how to you know、uh, help them with that?、Uh, ask them. Who's the richest person、uh, in、uh, modern times? You know, who is the richest?、Uh, who, is the, who is the wealthiest person in our times? And who is the wealthiest person in, in in the ancient times? What did they do to achieve that kind of wealth? Right.、Uh, we have heard, you know, the ancient times, the Chinese、um, god of wealth is、uh, Fan Li. Uh, uh, he's very famous for you know giving many times. Three times of giving, three times of getting his cost plus profit back in business, and then when he earned much, he give back again. So that's the context. The modern times we have,、um, in Master Ching Kong times, of course now it's they are more wealthier than him. But in Master Ching Kong times, it was、um, Mr. Li Jiachen, Mr. Li Jiachen, right? The Hong back then, Hong Kong's、uh, richest, wealthiest person,、um, and. When when and he has a person next to him who has who has who has ability to、uh, calculate the oracles, and they say that he asked him,、uh, Mr. Li, how much do you think is enough for you in this life? You know, what's your goal of wealth in this life? He says、uh, about three hundred million, something like that, and he's like, no, no, you got more than that. You got way more than that.、Um, so this shows us that you know there are a lot of people might. Work much harder than Mr. Lee, you know, the wealthiest man in Hong Kong. But、um, 
that they are not necessarily richer than him. So this shows us that hard work is not the very cost of wealth. It's rather the cultivation. Cultivation of what? The cultivation of giving. You know. Um, if you can, try to use example close to you and your colleagues or your friends. You know, someone they can, they know, someone they see. Say, hey, um, so, uh, 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 John has, you know, uh, not really hard working his job, but he earns a lot of money just by sitting there for three hours. Or um, Amy has, uh, I mean, uh, Adrian, uh, uh, on the other hand, Adrian works hard, OT every day, but the wealth he gained is not as much as John. So you can use close example around you to illustrate the fact. So what is the cost then? You know, if not the hard work, the cost is the giving of wealth, you know, the act of giving. The condition is the hard work. This the career, the, the the job you're having right now. It's the condition, and the effect is the wealth accumulation. Uh, I would I very well recommend Liao Fan Four Lessons uh, as a base, uh, as a you know book to look for if you want to achieve uh, wealth or achieve uh, change in your destiny. Uh, Master Ching Kong is an example. He's supposed to be uh, passed away at the age of 45. Uh, as proven by his um, grandfather, the male member of his Hebat family. But he made it to 96. He made it so far, double it. That is a very live example of, um, a raw example of, you know, one destiny being changed. Um, and another question we have to ask, why do you need so much money for? Why do you need this money for? What is the point of this? You know, all these Sorry for my word, rat race. What's the whole point of all this grinding? All right. If the purpose is to compare, to show off, I'm wealthy, then it's, it's very bad. It's not going to end happily ever after uh, with that kind of mindset. Uh, because what is happiness? All right. There are happiness that came from inside, from gratitude, from, you know, giving, servicing people, helping people, you know. There are also another kind of happiness that is, you know, buying a very expensive stuff, you know, getting um, uh, stimulated by external excitement, external sourced, you know, you get excited. So if we follow the happiness from inside, it's long lasting. If we allow ourselves drown in the drugs of excitement, you know, it doesn't have to be drug itself, like, anything that's from the outside that excites us, then we we are hooked and we we will we will get more and more miserable as we get because it will get desensitized and you need more excitement, more thrill, more fun. It's like a drug, essentially. So that is why it makes us think about depression. Why some people earn so much money but end up even more depressed? You know, why can't they find that sort of happiness if even though they have five Riverside or uh, seaside properties of Ferraris. Right. So, yeah, So, um, uh, putting effort has results, right? Every effort has result, but that result is not necessarily a good result. Amito. Uh, I think we have a very deep uh, and uh, very practical as well, you know, something very deep, something very practical for us. Uh, venerable, thank you so much. Sifu, uh, you have a final question? It's about it. We would like to... We are not sorry, we have a few minutes left, so let's see if uh, Venerable uh, is very kind, uh, extend another 10 minutes for us. So we have 20 minutes, uh, about 80 minutes left uh, for us to talk about, uh, you know, our questions uh, that, you know, we encounter on daily life. Guys, any questions, please ask. How? Thank you. 
，哦，所以大家从参到友啊，这个集思广益啊，就很有效果。李总翻译一下。Thank you, uh, uh, Sister Yuejia, for sharing the、uh, the the story of the actor who listened to the Dharma and learned the giving and eventually changed his life.、Uh, this is how you know. This is the point of this forum. It helps you know to gather everyone's and then people who knows share the examples and to achieve the、uh, goal of you know reminding us you know this teaching works. It actually works,、uh, giving us confidence. This example, the leader Ong, ah. 我们都认识。The main character of the story, we all know him. 啊，陈德也有请他呢，呃，分享了。啊，我是想说可以翻成英文啊，到时候再供养给大家。这个特别能彰显这个真的是布施的财富。呃 ，This person we are actually all know him, and uh. We like to,、uh, you know, like I like to, you know, have this translated in English, so to share to everyone, so that we all know, giving of wealth really gets us the wealth, change the destiny in terms of wealth. Oh, 那现在这个岳家有提出来了，哦，很喜欢传统文化，啊，但是在当前这个修学跟工作，啊，我们怎么来安排，来抉择，好。那他提出的这个问题啊，不知道诸位忍者有没有你自己的体会啊？哦，角度啊，可以，哎，可以提供给这个乐家，哎，乐家忍者啊。So about balancing between, uh, work, uh, between the Dharma career and the, you know, between propagating the traditional Chinese culture and the Dharma. And taking care of your own family, your parents, your responsibility obligations.、Uh, anyone has any ideas? How do we balance two of these? No. Regarding these questions, I like to share. Like、um, when we talk about balance,、uh, balance between two two person. I mean, this dharma commitment, commitment to propagate, and our job or our you know mortgage, our family. Um, it does not exclude each other, right? I think we can have a like a schedule, like a roster, right? Every Saturday, you know, like if you have a family of your own, every Saturday morning is exclusively for the temple, or、uh, every Sunday is for the temple. Every Saturday is for my own、uh, family time. So that's based on my experience、uh, how I differentiate these two、uh, better. 就是有一个顺序这样子，就是排表这样子，时间表这样子，对。啊，每一个人人生阶段呢，哎，都有他可能要比较努力的地方。比方说，当学生呢，就比较要努力在学业上。呃、uh, ，at every stage in our life, right? As a student, we need to focus on studies. 但也能够。去关心到父母啊，尽我们为人子的本分的。And there's always a need to take care of our parents, you know,、uh, make sure they um they're they're happy with where we are at the moment. That's our obligation as a children. 啊、哦，所以尽到孝不是说你要很多时间，而是你很真心啊、哦，父母都能感受到的。To be filial, to love and respect your parents, it's not just simply of you know set aside a time for them, but also every, the when you with them, you actually、um, you know pour in your heart and your love, spend quality time with them instead. Oh, 而且他的努力呢，也他学习也没有离开孝道啊，因为他学的越好呢，他父母越欢喜了。啊，他学的好呢。他以后有能力啊，可以很好的去找到好工作啊，去服务啊，这个都是安父母的心啊。And、uh, study does not、uh, deviate, you no know, study does not deviate from you know our obligation to our dear parents.、Um, as you progress well in your studies, you also make them happy. That's how you know you put their heart at ease. 
and with a good results, you're able to access more opportunities uh, in career, and you're doing well there, and thus making them even happier. Um, so this is a you know closely related things. Yeah. 啊，看跟刚刚岳家提出来的问题，还有没有网友要给他回应的 ？So back to the original question, uh, from uh 岳家啊 ，Sister 岳家 ，um, have we, um, anyone has any comment on that？ 谢谢这个吴居士的分享啊，那、啊、老法师啊，教导我们，我们学佛啊，一定让家庭啊越来越和乐。啊、哦，假如让家庭不和乐，这就学错了。嗯。啊 ，Thank you, Mr. Wu, for、uh, sharing the、uh, story, um, the real life story of himself. You know how his family gets happier and、uh, more complete with the Buddhism. This is how it should be a good example of、uh, learning the Buddhism right. And you know, this is a good example of you know answering the question of balancing between family and the commitments to the Dharma propagation. It should be helping each other, bettering each other. The 修行的路上啊，一定会有起起伏伏，不可能是一帆风顺的啊。啊、哦，那就像这个吴居士讲到的啊，我们能够坚定我们的信心。啊，这些观察都都能够通过的啊。It's normal to have ups and downs and adversities, uh, in in the path, you know, in this path of cultivation, uh, as uh, Mr. Wu has illustrated. Um, but most important thing is to persist and stay on the path. Uh, don't uh sway from it. We'll get there one day. 啊，那佛法呢，是圆融的，是世事无碍的。啊，这个精神呢、啊，我们要在自己的人生当中呢，去体会。Buddhism is well-rounded. It's、um, all-encompassing. There is、um, no blockage in any angles.、Uh, but the thing is, we need to use、um, our day-to-day -day life to. Experience it. Experience its well-roundedness. Experience is its、uh, all-encompassing、um, part. You know, 就像呃，善财童子五十三餐，哎，就说明了呢，菩萨道啊，在各行各业，在男女老少啊，甚至于是在我们的一个角色。啊，比方说我们是家庭主妇，都可以行菩萨道，这个没有碍、没有障碍的。嗯、um, ，just like the、uh, the example in Flower Adornment Sutra， 嗯、uh, ，the、uh, Bodhisattva s a n c h a i you know， the one who can amass wealth， 嗯、um, ，he example of you know encountering fifty three different people， right， fifty three different。People from all walks of life that become his teacher, no matter who they are, what they are. It shows us bodhisattva is everywhere, every corner of the、uh, world existence. We can learn from each of them. We can learn from every one of them, good and bad. 就像我们举一个例子啊，他是商人啊，稻盛和夫先生。哎，他经他在从商。哎，他把老祖宗的教导啊，就是儒释道、圣人的教导，用在他的企业里面了。他就是在企业行菩萨道了。而当他做出成绩的时候呢，他现身说法，那他的影响不输给一个传统文化弘法的老师哦。但是他却在他的那个领域里面。也产生了对社会教化的效果。An、uh, example we can relate a lot is、um, Inamori Kazuo. Mr. Inamori Kazuo has、um, is such a person, right? He's a businessman, but he used the teaching of、um, you know Confucius teaching, you know the Buddhist teaching, 
in his management of the business. You know, he had founded two companies. He saved the Japanese airline from the brink of bankruptcy. He, the way he treat the people, the way he bring up a company, you know, without asking for compensation. These are real example, you know, of bodhisattva exists in anywhere uh, in our world, in our life. Um, his influence could also can also be even more influential if he did well like him more influential than uh, even some uh, teacher who dedicated in teaching of this traditional culture so you everyone can be a good role model 当然假如你的愿望你还是很希望要像老和尚这样专门走弘法的路呢那佛事门中有求必应还是求得到都跟你弘法立身是分不开的那那几年呢要调服下来我才有东西可以去供养给社会大众也不操心。Thank也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不操心。也不
he do not uh, suddenly say, I want to be, uh, you know, 100% propagating Dharma all of a sudden. You know, he continued on his own path uh, at, at the time. Uh, and because of all the efforts he put, he poured into his job and, and his vow to go uh, towards the path uh, of Master Ching Kong, naturally, uh, you know, time comes and calls for his help. And he has the expertise, he has the experience uh, to do that. So it naturally put him in that position uh, to, to lead the teaching of traditional Chinese culture. And that's where he is. He was and then gradually lead to where he is now. So it will come by itself. We need to focus on the present. Oh, so now the biggest thing we can do right now at the moment is to use this teaching, you know, traditional Chinese teaching, the teaching we learned today, the the values, put it in the work, put it in our uh, daily encounters, daily affairs. Now, that's the biggest contribution we can make right now. Put it in our daily role, daily life. You will be a good husband, good wife, good uh, worker, you know, good boss, good children. Yeah. Oh, 都能解决得了 As long as there is a there is a oh, way, there's a way uh, <laughs> as long as there is a teaching um, you know from the as long as with Buddhism with the wisdom of the ancestors there is a way to solve whatever problem we encounter there is no that他就是问到呢这个假如说工作当中有供养冷斗的肉啊这样算不算杀生 if uh, there is a uh, in the job we have to deal with frozen meat, does it encounter as killing? Oh,我想我们参与的也算是共业。啊,那看你参与的深入,或者参与的是主要的因素,那这个业就重。啊,不是主要的因素啊。Participation. It's based on how deep, how widely involved we are in this act. If you deeply participate in the act of killing, of course your karma will be heavier. If, you know, like this one, you're just at the site, um, you're not really directly participate in it, you're not deep in it, in, deeply involved in it, then your karma will be lighter. <laughs> Uh,我们选择,啊,像年轻人,选择行业,这个也是很重要的。啊,比方说,啊,你选择医生,哇,他可以救很多人的命。啊,或者你选择老师,啊,你可以开发很多人的会命。哎,这些行业,很有价值。
，不造恶业，啊，甚至于是这个工作本身又很有意义，还能够不断积累你自己的福报的行业来做，啊，那但是不要一下子很激动啊，今天啊，我跟大家一讲完了，你马上就辞掉工作啊。家里的人都不理解啊，一下子开始担心下个月没钱了啊！你们家这个一下子烦恼都起来了，我就罪过罪过了哈、啊！不要太冲动啊，要要先跟家里的人沟通好了呵呵，然后再来做这个调整。哦，那还没有调整好以前呢、啊，啊，我们呢用很真诚的心念佛啊，做功德，回向给这一些。在我们工作当中啊，这个可能造成的伤害的这些众生，我们都给他回向啊，把这一个缘呢、啊、转成法缘啊。嗯、um, ，So everyone has their own merit in the past, and this translate through your job, how much you earn in your job. And so it's always good to avoid because if we avoid any act or any job that invokes、uh, a negative karma like killings,、uh, etc.,、uh, because doing that will harm,、uh, will、um, will exhaust your、uh, past merit faster, and will hurt you as well in long run. Of course,、um, having said that, don't just like you know when when you hear this sermon、uh, teaching、uh, from me,、uh, venerable,、uh, you immediately quit your job and then causing you in、uh, financial hardships.、Uh, that is not wise、uh, because it will worry your family, you will worry、uh, people who rely on you、uh, for financial help. So、uh, you know what you can do now. After aware of this, is to dedicate your merits back to the sentient beings. You know those beings that were being harmed. So you can turn around this relationship into one that is、uh, based on dharma, you know, rather than you know vengeance and retaliations.、Uh, use your sincere heart and dedicate your、um, chanting merit to them. 好，那这个我想呢，啊，我们诸位这个。尤其是年轻的朋友们啊，啊，你们呢可以有问题的时候啊，提供到我们呃雪梨金钟学会啊。假如有超过五个问题了啊，我们就可以啊在网上啊大家再聚。哦，所以这个这个时间呢，我们不不定时啊，就是说有大家提问了，我们就尽快。可以大家一起来互相探讨，互相切磋啊！那结束以前呢，要跟大家介绍一篇教诲啊，是我们黄念祖老居士啊，他呢送一批年轻人啊，他们刚好要到日本呢、啊、去拿博士学位啊，那老人家在他们出行前呢、啊，给了他们一段很好的开示。这一段开示啊，包含了啊，针对他们的学业、他们的往后的职业，包含他们找对象、成立家庭啊，这个教法非常圆满哈、哦。我们现在快要完成了，把它翻成英文了哈、哦。我我们尽快啊，提供给大家啊、哦。那大家在在学习工作之余啊。能够把它看完之后啊，我们下一次聚会的时候可以针对这些内容，我们进一步可以再做探讨。哦，比方说黄老这些教诲很好啊，可是我可能实际上在操作的时候是不是有哪些困难？这个我们都可以拿出来再探讨啊、哦，这个就有切磋的效果了啊。啊、uh, ，Thank you, Rebo. Uh, so. Next round, right? We will form this forum again when we have more than five questions、uh, accumulated、uh, from everyone,、uh, especially the youth groups.、Uh, please send it to the、uh, Amitabha New South Wales、um, uh, Gmail、uh, if you have uh, questions uh, in this uh, nature. And、um, also,、um, venerable, like to share about the、um, teachings from、uh, Master Huang Nianzhu. Uh, Master Huang, uh, on all these uh, uh, foreign, I mean, these exchange students 
Japan, uh, Chinese students exchange in, uh, in, in Japan. Uh, he gave them a series of um, uh, teachings, uh, a Q&A, like what we have today regarding everyday, everyday life, you know, finding partners, uh, careers, um, you know, uh, cultivations. And we are working, uh, Venerable is working hard and his team is working hard to translate this to English. It's almost done. And when it's done, we use this as a template for our next discussion. So hopefully we'll bring out, you know, points of view or questions that you encounter and so that you can ask yeah, in the next forum. 这个俗话说啊，站在巨人的肩膀上看得更远啊、哦，所以相信呢，我们能珍惜像黄老啊、哦、这样大慈悲的善知识的教诲，我们能珍惜我们祖先五千年的智慧啊啊，那我们的人生少走很多弯路啊啊，然后一定能够嗯、呃、获得我们人生的幸福，甚至于是这一生的。As a saying goes,、uh, standing on the shoulder of a giant allows us to look at the horizon we never imagined we could see. So、um, hopefully we can use、uh, a giant like Master Huang Nianlao、uh, teaching、uh, to help us, you know, to achieve what we want in our life and all, and even you know, perfect the very end of our life, you know, as we reach its end. So thank you. 好，那再次感谢我们郑总贤抗力哈，还有我们啊迪伦哈，还有我们雪梨诸位同修的协助帮忙，还有大家的参与哈，谢谢大家，阿弥陀佛 ，Thank you very much, Thank you everyone， 阿弥陀佛。这个最后呢，跟大家推荐一本书啊，这个我们有把《群书三六零》啊，前三册的精华，啊，又把它。截取出来了，编成这一本《群书治要》中修齐治品的智慧啊，现在英文版出来了，哦，所以你可以从修身齐家治国平天下这四个角度去查这个书，呵呵挺方便的。好、哦，那这个对于我们啊，包含华人呐、啊，或者是啊其他越南呐、啊、日本、韩国啊这些对于汉文化觉得很认同的。哎，都可以用结跟他们结缘，好，那我们以地方啊，这我们看雪梨经商学会需要多少，我们再寄，哦，哪边需要多少呢？我我们可以用寄的，好，好，啊，这个是我们马来西亚这个校长职工会印的，哎，好，这边的中华文化教育协会印的。Uh, Venerable sharing this uh, uh, 360 quotes uh, from uh, now it came from 360 quotes、uh, compiled into this book: wisdom of self cultivation, family management, governing a country, and bringing peace to the world. In this book called Qin Shu Zhiyao,、uh, it's、uh, you know Venerable like to share it with everyone.、Uh, we might get the if you're interested, you know, bring it up to Uncle James and、uh, the,、um, the email, and、uh, we will book a certain amount of books in our、uh, Sydney Book Distribution Center. Amitofo. So prepare your questions so we can see Venerable sooner.、Uh, the more question you have, the sooner we will be able to see Venerable again. Oh, oh. 然后这边还看到我们越南的同修啊啊，越南同修学习的这种认真呢、啊，哦、啊，也是值得我们效法哈啊,啊。他们对中华文化的珍惜啊，呃、啊，我觉得比比我还还恭敬啊。那这个老和尚有说啊，受汉文化影响最大的四个地方哈、啊，就中国之外呢，日本、韩国还有越南，哦，所以呃，我们可能呢很快啊，呃，会组织啊，呃，用越南话哈、啊，越南话来来交流中华传统文化，哎。像啊，像今天是以英文为主啊，那个之后那个是以越南文为主啊啊，只有我讲中文，其他都讲越南文。<笑>我们可以再来交流啊，把这些地区啊，我们尽一点力啊，慢慢慢慢带动起来啊，因为这个世界啊，需要中华文明的智慧
啊，我们最近也看到哇，这个这一两年战争呢、啊，啊，乌克兰呢、啊，现在又以色列啊，这些情况啊，这是世界的情况，包含个人身心的问题都越来越多啊，啊，这样忧郁症越来越多了，所以真的很需要我们东方的文明啊，来利益这个世界啊。所以，我们身为佛弟子啊，我们要为众开法藏啊，广施功德宝啊，这个于诸众生失落自己，整济负荷，皆度彼岸啊。我们来尽一点心力啊，阿弥陀佛。v e r a b l e say like you know, I have seen so many uh dear Vietnamese brothers and sisters practitioners here. Um, their respect. I mean, their Uh, sincerity, their reverence towards the um the teachings of the Chi- uh Chinese culture, the ancestor, you know, the the values of the traditional Chinese culture is even more than I have, uh if I dare say, um and because of that, I think I would try to uh initiate a another discussion group, uh with our uh, in Vietnamese about the teachings of you know the Confucius, the Buddha, the Chinese culture, uh in, in upcoming uh sessions. Um, also, uh, there are four um, countries or four civilizations that are heavily influenced by the um, uh, traditional Chinese culture. One is Chinese uh, China, uh, and then uh, Korea, Japan, and Vietnam. And uh, these four uh, regions, countries, have deeply affected by these values uh, system, and. And in light of recent two three years of、uh, you know warfare being、uh, invoked in Ukraine, now Israeli Palestinian conflicts,、uh, we have also seen a lot of、um, rapid rise in depressions. We have、uh, noticed a very urgent need on this kind of Eastern wisdom, you know, the wise the wisdom from the East, the way to deal with people relationship from the East. Uh, into that part of the world, and it's our job and duty as the、uh, Buddhist, as the you know、uh, inheritors of this culture, to pass on this、um, wisdom, share this with them, with everyone else. So this is what we're trying to do at the moment.、Uh, all the best, Amitofo. Ah, 那刚好，老和尚在台湾成立了智善基金会啊，啊，有资助了一位越南的法师啊。而且他是汉学方面的博士学位，现在在台湾做博士后，啊，专门翻译啊老和尚讲的经教，啊，所以，呃，我们办这个交流会啊，他会亲自来做翻译。啊，呃 ，so Venerable Master Ching Kong has、uh, sponsored a、uh, uh, Vietnamese、uh, monk to learn from、uh, you know. Uh, the Chinese culture in sinology、uh, studies, and、uh, he's now currently translating the、uh, sutras,、uh, the talks given by him,、uh, Master Ching Kong, from Chinese to Vietnamese. And so, in our upcoming session, you know, in foreseeable future, conducted in Vietnamese, we'll invite these venerable、uh, to the session as my、uh, as venerable Chengde's translators. 师父，请问这位法师是怎么称呼啊？哦，福祥法师。啊、哦，他、uh, venerable 福祥，<笑>他自己在越南也有他的道场。<笑> And he has a dharma place in the、uh, Vietnam. Venerable 福祥， yeah. 当然，希望我们越南同修啊，在这个因缘当中多多切磋啊，跟这个法法师多学习啊。我们以后雪梨金钟学会用越南文来弘法。Uh, so hopefully we have more chances, you know, cooperate between Venerable Fu Xiang and, you know, the Vietnamese、uh, brother and sister in、uh, Sydney, New South Wales, so that you know we can propagate Dharma better in from Sydney. Ah, Amitabha. 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 Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. 啊、哦，再见！希望很快再见到师傅。谢谢师傅。好的，好的。阿弥陀佛。谢谢师傅。再见。